And here we are at the racetrack again, but nobody's racing yet, unless this guy is. Doesn't look like it. Hartford is a little town southwest of Kalamazoo. As I said, I think the racetrack is still there, but you guys who live down there could tell me. Lance, you could tell me. That looks like about a 58 Olds, maybe, or a Chrysler. There's my dad doing his electric thing. Putting in poles, putting in boxes. At one time, after Dad and Mary got married in 1966, they had horses. My dad was in the sheriff's posse at one point. So not only did he ride boats and airplanes, he also rode horses. I started to tell you about the egg business where he would go out to, seems like the guy's name was Linderman, who had the chickens, and he would buy the eggs from him and take them back to the garage, which no longer served as a garage at that point. It served as an egg candling place, and we would candle eggs and size them. That was in 1971 that he did that. I'm not even sure exactly where this racetrack is, but it looks like it, that's a main highway out there, so that could be Red Arrow Highway. This is by Grandma's house. You can see Grandma's house there and the lilac bush. And David and I were picking lilacs. Grandma had chickens, and she had a rooster. Cheryl, remember the rooster? He always used to go after you, and I just never did. I never went to Grandma's house because I didn't want to get tangled up with the rooster. There's my grandfather. So this is before 1962. This might even be the summer of 62. I'm not sure. It almost looks like Grandpa has a mask on. I can't imagine that unless he was sick at that point with the cancer. And David, this is just north of the garage. Those pine trees, I believe, are still there. Oh, Dad and his airplanes. <laughs> Probably one of the first jets, I don't know, when they had, they had jets in World War II, didn't they? So, But I'm sure this was a passenger jet. And I know that everybody is really excited about watching this, and so we can't see them now. But back then, it was an unusual sight. That, I think, is LCJ. And she's headed out, out to sea, out to lake. There's the yacht club, the brown building. South Haven has changed so very, very much. 